Red Taylor Zero it involves only two decks of cards. A black deck and a white deck. Now each deck represents a kingdom, okay? You've got a black kingdom, which is very far away from the white kingdom. Now, um, spectators can choose any kingdom they like. Let's say they prefer the black deck. We'll leave that aside for the main part of the trick. And for now, we'll use the white deck to help us out. Now, obviously, a, uh, a kingdom has got to have a king. So let's just uh, choose a king. Let's just use the first one I came to, the king of spades. Now you see, the king of spades is a very lonely king. He has no wife, he has no children. And he found out that uh, he was actually separated at birth from an identical twin brother. And he wanted you to find him, okay? He went off to the black kingdom. Whereas this king that we see right here went off to the white kingdom. But they didn't know about each other. And he's just found out. So he wants your help. Now you see this uh, sword thing right here? If you don't help him out, he's just going to uh, chop off your head. I know it sounds mean, but um, you know he's a king and that's what they do. So do you want to help him out? Yeah, yeah. I, I think you probably do. Now what he wants you to do is just go through the deck and pick out any card you like. Now this decision will shape uh, your fate. So whichever one they like, let's say they prefer this card. Okay, the Jack of Hearts. Okay, hopefully this is a good choice. I feel for you if it's not. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the, uh, the Jack of Hearts and uh, we're going to use it to help us out, okay? What we're going to do is we're going to deal down J-A-C-K-O-F-H-E-A-R-T-S and hopefully if we're lucky enough we should land on the Seven of Spades. That's not the King of Spades brother. It looks like you're in a bit of peril. But actually, the King sees something in you. He actually decides that he's going to give you a second shot at things. So we're going to use the seven of spades now. So if we do down S-E-V-E-N-O-F-S-P-A-D-E-S, hopefully with a little bit of magic we should land on one card, and it is, of course, the king's identical twin brother. Perfect. Now the kings have met up. They thank you. But now, because your help has been so good, they actually ask you that they want you to find this king's brothers, because he was actually separated, not from identical twin brothers, but from his, also his brothers at birth. So the two kings decide that in order to find uh, the black king's brothers, what they're going to do is they're actually going to deal down their name. K-I-N-G-O-F-S-P-A-D-E-S. And with a wave and a magic touch, we should actually be able to find the other three kings. Perfect. But, you see, the kings have wives, and they want you to find them. But don't worry, along the way I had you covered, you don't need to worry about this, because along the way I actually picked up the kings matching wives, the queens. So I hope you enjoyed that, guys. That's a uh, pretty quick... Um, trick uses a lot of cards. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.